Okay, I'm going to demonstrate the new Record Tour option in Google Earth 5. And I'm going to do this first by flying down to the Grand Canyon. And I've hit the Record button and I'm recording my motions, which I'm doing by using the Space Navigator. And the neat thing is with the new Record Tour option, it'll record whether you use the mouse or double click on place marks or use the Space Navigator and you get a real sense of how the Space Navigator operates from looking at this demo. So I'm moving in really slow to the edge of the rim so you have a chance to load the 3D terrain. Hopefully you have the terrain layer turned on. I love going to the Grand Canyon and you can look right down over the edge. Um, in Google Earth, the Grand Canyon is so realistic. Uh, I, I've actually been to the Grand Canyon a number of times myself, including walking down to the bottom. I'm taking you now down to the river, where the Colorado River goes down through the Grand Canyon. And uh, now you're looking back. There's where we started, up at the top. And we're going to fly upriver, upstream. You can't do this in, a, in the rafts. You have to go only downstream. But we're going to go upstream. And I'm going to take you to the bottom of the main trail that goes up to the Grand Canyon Village uh, at the top of the South Rim. And uh, we're going up the river, and there's actually a bridge that crosses the river, which I've walked across. Uh, here's the bridge, and I've got a waypoint or a place mark here. And if we click on that, um, you actually hey, there's a photo I've copied from the Panoramio site that shows you the bridge. And the neat thing is with Record Tour, you can include place marks and open them up as part of the Record Tour playback. And now we're going to follow the trail. And this is the Bright Angel Trail along the east side of the river. And this is where it starts going back up. And uh, here's the trail again. And just another place mark to show how that works. And now we're going to follow along the trail. And there's some switchbacks starting up the steeper part of the canyon. And then you get over to another higher level plateau. And you get along here and there's a good breaking point about right here. There's a little park with some trees you can take a break at. And, um, and even some shelters there. And then we go zooming or walking up. And there's a bunch of switchbacks along here which you can't see in the shadow but they're there. And then you make your way all the way up to the top, and there's the Grand Canyon Village. So there's a demonstration of the tour.